Hi everyone, my name's Emily from Supplies for Candles and today I'm going to be showing you how to create a container candle using our new Pro Soy Container Wax. Pro Soy Container Wax is an all natural specialty blend wax of soy, coconut and palm and comes in small pellets. To make a Pro Soy candle, you will firstly need a set of weighing scales, a pouring jug, fragrance oil, a container, we've got a wick, a wick centering tool, a thermometer and then of course your heat source. You can either use a double boiler or like I have here, a hob and a pan and of course your Pro Soy wax. So let's get started. First step is to wick in your container. I have chosen the 20 centilitre candle container for my candle, along with a TCR 2716 wick. To wick your candle, firstly make sure that the container is clean and dry, then take a wick stickum and apply this to the base of your wick. From there, you can then place the wick into the centre of your container. Step two is melting your wax. For this 20 centilitre candle, I've weighed out 160 grams of wax, which I will then transfer over to my pan. I'm going to heat the wax to 80 degrees Celsius and monitor the temperature using my thermometer. Ensure that you don't exceed 80 degrees Celsius as this may affect the colour and quality of the wax. Step 3. With our wax now melted, it's time to add our fragrance oil. Here, we've already decanted our melted wax into our pouring jug and I've selected my favourite fragrance from Supplies for Candles. I've already pre-weighed my fragrance oil and have around 6%. Our Pro Soy container wax is specifically designed to hold a high level of fragrance oil, but as a starting point, we recommend a ratio of 6% fragrance to wax. I can see that my wax has now cooled to pouring temperature, so now I'm going to give it a gentle but thorough stir to ensure that the fragrance and wax both blend together to give us a great scent throw. This specifically formulated blend boasts great glass adhesion, smooth appearance and strong colours when dyes are added. With our fragrance and wax combined, our mixture is now ready to go into our container. I'll steadily pour the wax into our glass and leave around a 1cm gap at the top. To ensure our candle sets with a straight wick, I have added a wick centering tool. For the best results, leave your candle to set and cure for at least 24 hours. And here is my finished candle. We hope you've enjoyed using our Pro Soy Wax and we can't wait to see your finished results. Don't forget to tag Supplies for Candles by using the hashtag SFC feature me so we can have a look at all your wonderful creations.